I have a lot of spirit, and I keep going. And for the last nine years, 90-year-old Molly Kaplan has kept her spirits high by making dolls out of wire and stuffed with paper and covered with fabric from her old dresses and decorated with buttons and beads and costume jewelry. She calls her colorful, faceless creations guardian spirit dolls. They have no features because spirits do not have features. Whatever the spirit moves me at the moment will go into them. The spirit of Valentine's Day went into this. I call her Valentina. Her skirt is made in the shape of a heart. A good time spirit visited her as she watched TV on New Year's Eve. I have to celebrate it somehow. So I made her, and she is saying, she's all bright, and she's saying, Happy New Year. Give me a hug. And this purple one, well... Should I say it? Purple passion. <clears throat> she uses the old fabrics to make pillows, too, and wall hangings. She also makes elephants, and it was spirits of a different sort that inspired her first one, a pink elephant. I was asked, after having a half a glass of beer the night before, uh, if I was still drunk the following day, and my remark was, oh, yes, I saw pink elephants all night long. She sells the small ones for about $20, loves each one so much that she apologizes to them when she sells them. Inside each spirit doll, she stuffs a written wish of good fortune. A wish from deep down inside the doll that will likely never get read. Well, I know, but the thought was there. In Durham, Don Ross, News Channel 11, ABC.